The permanent exhibition of the history of legal and judicial costume is the largest and most important collection of judicial and legal robes in the country. On display is a magnificent array of legal costumes stretching back several centuries. The exhibition is located in London, within the Royal Courts of Justice in the Strand. Founded in 1971, it provides a unique educational resource as well as a welcome point of interest for those who visit this magnificent Gothic building in which it is located. Here I am in the exhibition's main gallery at the Royal Courts of Justice, which was opened in 1996. There are display cabinets housing a rotating collection of legal robes and artefacts. Costumes worn by judges and advocates have formed a part of our legal processes throughout history. In addition to this main gallery at the northern end of the building, there is a separate gallery closer to the main entrance. Between the two, you will be able to walk through the cathedral-like Grand Hall of the Royal Courts and admire its grandeur. The black and gold robe you see is the ceremonial robe. It is made of silk brocade and heavy gold. It was worn by my father as Lord Chancellor. In the meanwhile, my grandfather had worn it as King's Counsel and Attorney General. It was given to me in 1989 when I myself became Queen's Counsel. When our father died in 2001, the family felt it would be appropriate for the family robes to be made available for display to the public. The exhibition has a strong educational role. We accommodate school visits. The exhibits provide a reference point to promote discussion, aiding understanding of the law and encouraging participation in it. We play an important part in the open house scheme at the Royal Courts of Justice where we welcome many thousands of visitors and where we offer the public and particularly children the opportunity to try on judicial robes from our reserve collection. Uh, this present age seems inclined to discard such customs. Uh, it's very important that we shouldn't lose the material evidence uh, together with the customs themselves. The robes and artefacts which we've been collecting here for 40 years are worth preserving in their own right. They're part of the cultural heritage of this nation. My name is Kasia Kolendarska and I take care and conserve the costumes for the exhibition. This robe needs some conservation treatment and we need to treat the neck area which um, has quite a lot of damage on the ermine which disconnected from the woolen part. This work is very painstaking but very very satisfying on the other hand because we are preserving robes for future generations to enjoy and admire and I'm very proud to be part of that. The permanent exhibition is a registered charity administered by the chairman and management committee all of whom are volunteers. In this short video we have tried to give you an idea of the importance of this exhibition and its educational and historical significance. The cost of maintaining an exhibition of this quality uh, is, as you can imagine, very substantial. The exhibition is funded entirely by voluntary donations. We would very much welcome your donation. Thank you very much indeed for watching.